and an unintentional injury, but Merkley unfortunately suffered his second major knee injury of his career, the former first round draft pick. Turnover, Gambrell moving in, puck on his stick, turns, fires, scores! Toss those teddies! Gambrell has tied this one up as he picks it off in the high slot, moves in, gets Miska down, and he deposits it just inside the left post. And the Teddies are raining down here at SAP Center. So we'll have a delayed break here because it's going to take a while for them to be completely thrown on the ice. It's going to take a while to completely clean them up. The players will assist. Right now, San Jose's players are starting to shovel them into piles here. Their goal for Gambrell, man, is he found his stride as of late. Dylan Gambrell had goals in three straight games prior to Wednesday. And he's got another one here for San Jose. The rookie forward is red hot right now for the Barracuda. He's got his seventh of the year. He's got points now in six of his last eight games, does Dylan Gambrell. Four goals and four assists. And the teddy bears continue to rain down here. We've got a ginormous teddy bear. I've seen big bears here before. That takes a small army to get over the glass. And that's the biggest bear I've ever seen in my life. That thing is humongous. And it, sometimes these things are human size. That thing's about twice. That's a Sasquatch. Massive. As they continue to rain teddy bears down here as Dylan Gabriel has lit the lamp for San Jose. The time of the full strength tally for the rookie forward comes at the 12.29 mark here in this opening period. So Tucson able to score on the power play and San Jose did not wait long. What a really brilliant move by Gambrell. He got Miska down out of the stomach, a little bit of a shimmy shake style move as he moved in on the goal center, intercepting a Bad outlet attempt by Tucson. And as he got him down, there was about 12 inches of space between Miska's left skate and the post. And Gabriel patiently just kind of tucked it inside the post. As the Bears continue to rain down here, as fans who are near the top of this up of this first bowl here at SAP Center. Who I uh, didn't have the arm shake to throw some of these big bears. They just made their way down to the glass and are still continuing to toss them and pull them out of their bags. Last year's uh, record, 4,500 bears. And I would certainly guess we've surpassed that this season. They're continuing to collect them here at SAP Center as they continue to rain down onto the ice. The checker out of town scores while we're Waiting on the cleanup here at the tank. Rockford has a 4-3 lead on Chicago. That game is in the third period at the All-State Arena. The Wolves coming into the contest ahead of the Ice Hogs at 16-9, and one in that central division. But right now it is the visiting Rockford Ice Hogs who have a 4-3 lead. We've got a touchdown apiece in Iowa between the Stockton Heat and the Iowa Wild. It is a 7-7 hockey game with still 11 minutes to go in the 